Hello everyone, I am Dr. Pratik Joshi. I am a practicing orthopedic surgeon at Atharva Orthopedic Hospital, Ahmedabad. Today is 12th October, which is celebrated as World Arthritis Day. So on this occasion, I am going to share some knowledge about arthritis, which is a common medical condition characterized by inflammation and destruction of the joint and surrounding soft tissue. This process leads to swelling, severe pain and deformity in the joint ultimately translating into compromised joint function and quality of life. There are more than 100 types of arthritis known to us, but the most common arthritis are osteoarthritis and rheumatoid arthritis. Due to lack of awareness and support, arthritis and its related conditions have crippled the life of most of the people all around the world. So it is important for people to be aware about this medical condition and take medical help in time to prevent its long-standing complications. How do you know whether you have arthritis? So if you have long-standing non-traumatic pain, stiffness, swelling or deformity in any one of your joint or multiple joints, there is a possibility that you might be suffering from arthritis. I am going to share some of the important self-care tips to improve your joint health in general. Number one, you should include a good balanced nutritious diet with plenty of anti-inflammatory foods such as green leafy vegetable, berries, ginger, nuts, fiber, etc. Number two, you should prioritize vitamin D and calcium intake in your food. Number three, you should maintain your ideal body weight as carrying excess body weight is going to add stresses to our joints, especially the weight bearing joints. Number four, you should practice regular physical activities followed by low impact exercises such as swimming, walking or cycling. Number five, you should engage in yoga or meditation or similar activities because this is going to relax your muscle as well as stretch your muscles. And of course, smoking is not going to be helpful to your joints so you should try to reduce or stop smoking. I hope this information has been helpful to you. With this, I would like to conclude by wishing you all good health. Thank you.